the Indiana Pacers don't have to worry about Giannis Antetokounmpo trying to run up on them and punk them anymore because they just signed the scariest dude in the NBA. That's right. The Indiana Pacers have announced they just signed forward James Johnson to the roster. Now, if y'all ain't hip, let me give you the rundown on why James Johnson is the scariest dude in the NBA. Now, if his nickname ain't enough to scare you, I don't know what to tell you. The man they call Bloodsport has been a black belt since he got out the womb. He's currently a double black belt. Both his parents are black belts, and all eight of his siblings are also black belts. Oh, and might I add, when he's not on the court hooping, the man has a 7-0 MMA record and is 20-0 in kickboxing. Now, after that melee the Pacers had with the Bucks, it's easy to see they need an enforcer on that roster. You can't have teams out here punking your star players. If the Pacers had James Johnson on their roster last night when they faced the Bucks, none of that would have went down. Ain't no way in hell Bobby Portis gets the spazzing out on Aaron Neesmith if you got James Johnson on the court. The Pacers and the Bucks face off again on New Year's Day, and you can guarantee I'll be tuned into that one. And honestly, after the Pacers beat the Bucks in the in season tournament semifinals, with Tyrese Halliburton hitting the Bucks and Dame Lillard with the Dame Time celebration, and then the Bucks getting their revenge by beating up on the Pacers at home last night, which led to the melee the game ball getting stolen. I wouldn't mind seeing a seven game series of this. And now with James Johnson thrown into the mix, this is going to get real interesting. But that's all I got on this for now. Once again, you already know it's your boy Moose Talks Hoops. Like I always say, if you're new to my channel, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, and hit the like button you already know. It's a lot of things in this world that cost, but hitting the like button ain't one of them.